going on guys and welcome back to another video now in this video we're going to be talking about a topic that a lot of people have been requesting for quite a while actually and this is landing pages right we're going to be talking about all about landing pages today and actually this video is going to be in two parts in the first part we're going to discuss uh, how to create a really good landing page what makes a landing page effective uh, certain elements of a landing page the psychology be behind a really good landing page and then in the second part of the video I am going to actually walk with you on actually creating a landing page for an imaginary product okay that that probably already exists uh, in Clickbank or Max Bounty but we're just going to create take a brand new product uh, think of it and create uh, an angle for it and actually build out the landing page in real time okay so first of all I do realize that creating landing pages is work but when I tell you that you know 95 to maybe 99 percent of the time a landing page is going to convert better than if you're not using a landing page so if you're just direct linking you're going to have a much better in the long run a conversion when you are using a landing page okay and there's a lot of things you can do with a landing page we're going to cover all that so for instance you can collect emails uh, you can do a lot of amazing things and so over the years I've probably built hundreds of different landing pages and when I started out it was a lot of hassle and a lot of work and I really wanted to avoid it as much as possible but right now I actually like building landing pages because it allows me to communicate different value propositions about the product it allows me to actually sell the product and maybe perhaps build a new angle that you know maybe there is already a landing page uh, like you have with uh, Clickbank products or Max Bounty products but I see another angle I see a more effective way of selling it and I can test it I can create my own landing page I can use the built-in landing page and I can see which one converts better and so I, I view it as a game I really enjoy the process and after watching this video chances are you're going to enjoy it as well because I'm going to teach you some really uh, really key things that you should learn about building a landing page okay and so here's one of my landing pages that I probably showed before in some of the other videos and this is for a product called text chemistry and this is a landing page that I built myself it took me probably like 15 minutes to do it I was using it on a couple of campaigns and I actually have uh, some very interesting things here first of all when you click add to cart I'm actually collecting emails you cannot do that if you don't have a landing page obviously second of all I am actually when they uh, enter their email I'm redirecting them directly to the checkout page of, a, of the Clickbank product so I'm not just you know with a, with a regular landing page you're basically showing whatever the uh, the merchant is giving to you but I'm actually redirecting them uh, directly to the checkout so they don't really need to see another landing page so there's a lot of interesting things I can do and that that is why I view landing pages as kind of the next level the more advanced method it gives you a lot of flexibility and you can earn a lot more money with it okay and you're gonna get better conversions and things like that and so let's talk about this landing page real quick now first of all when you are designing a landing page you have to think about where is the customer at okay this particular landing page I'm already assuming that the person who is searching for this product they are searching uh they already they, they already know what the product is about so we are not targeting people who are looking for you know relationship advice or you know we're not targeting women who need help what to do with you know their their boyfriends or things like that we are targeting people well women especially that already know about this product okay they just they're looking for reviews they're looking for promo codes things like that so we're not targeting people women who are who have no idea that this product exists so this is the first thing okay because I'm already talking about I'm not talking about hey are you having relationship problems are you having you know these kinds of problems we're not talking about that we're talking directly hey what is what is text chemistry how does it work so we're looking we're, we're basically targeting women who are kind of in their middle to the to the bottom stages in their funnel they already decided that you know that they like this product they're just looking for promo codes uh, bonuses maybe some reviews things like that so that's very very important now you could be building these kinds of landing pages it's absolutely possible but chances are most of the time you're going to be building kind of different landing pages and I'm going to go to that in a second as well we're going to be talking about all kinds of landing pages okay so what is this landing page about I'm basically I'm talking a little bit about this product right that's all I'm doing here it's not a very long landing page and I'm basically including some bonuses okay so if they buy it from me they're going to get various bonuses 
and we also have 60 day 100 money back guarantee this is what the merchant offers we have some testimonials uh, we have some frequently asked questions so this is kind of this is uh, an ideal landing page for somebody that's on the edge right they're kind of on the edge should i buy the product should i not chances are they've already been exposed uh, to this product before they just need some further uh, reinforcement right they want to see some bonuses they want to see some more testimonials things like that and so i created this landing page and i'm actually bidding or i was bidding at some point on branded keywords i'm not bidding on keywords where people are looking for solutions i'm already bidding on people uh, who are actually searching for this specific product and in marketing this is called uh, like a middle of the funnel or towards the end of the funnel I would I would probably call this towards the end of the funnel so it's people who already know this product they're just looking for that little extra nudge that that last push to purchase this product and that's why we have a landing page and I'm basically redirecting them to the uh, to the checkout page in Clickbank now I want to show you a couple of other landing pages where a person is in the beginning of the funnel right and so here is I was I was basically and actually a really good way to find landing pages is to go to max bounty and basically go on e-commerce and you want to look at products with a high CPA rate you don't want to look at products with um, eight per lead because the lower the, the payout the more chance this is a CPA product, right? They're just looking for email opt-ins and things like that. But if you want to learn how to build landing pages, you should be looking at products with a high per lead. That means they want the user to, to actually purchase the product. And if they want to purchase the product, they're looking for that kind of commitment. Chances are they've probably put a lot of effort into their landing pages. And so I was browsing this and I found Copresent Socks Blood Circulation. Okay, and this is 32 per lead. I opened this landing, I opened this offer here and we can actually go to this landing page okay and here's what the landing page looks like and in this case they're basically targeting people at the top of the funnel but also middle and everywhere but they're also covering at the top of the funnel something that I wasn't doing in my own landing page okay and so chances are most of the time you're going to be building these kinds of landing pages so let's talk about this kind of landing page I really like this landing page this is a really nice landing page it covers all the bases it, it's a little long but that is because they're targeting top of the funnel they're targeting people who are new uh people who are who have a problem right maybe a health issue some kind of inconvenience that they're maybe uncomfortable a little bit they have some pain points they're not particularly looking to buy compression socks right if they were looking to buy compression socks this landing page would look more like my landing page but but it but it isn't and so they're you know they're basically targeting people who have a problem they haven't actually figured out if their products or anything like that and so let's quickly scan through this landing page and I'm going to tell you why I like this landing page so first of all we have a headline and we have basically they're listing three benefits right boost circulation relieve tired feet and legs enjoy greater comfort with a pair of coppers and compression socks so there are three benefits right off the bat okay boost circulation relieve tired feet and legs and enjoy greater comfort these are three benefits now each person you know these benefits can apply to different people in a different way for instance i don't really care about circulation but maybe i care about relieve tired feet and legs or another person might not care about the first two but they just want greater comfort okay maybe it's just not comfortable and somebody else might care about circulation okay maybe somebody older okay so this is very important they also listing average customer rating kind of these amazon uh, five star system which is a new thing right this is something they've been doing i guess in the last couple of years but people are so used to viewing these um ratings that they decided to incorporate and maybe this is something they were testing but you know since we're seeing it chances are it's working pretty well and so if we scroll down right the, the purpose of the headline is to grab your attention remember we're living in a tension economy right people are browsing all the time you're watching videos you're jumping back and forth we need to grab somebody's attention really quick if this doesn't grab anybody's attention then it doesn't really matter what happens they're not going to read the rest of it and, and they're certainly not going to buy the product so so this is the number one thing now personally I would probably you know I might even change this around because it's a little you know kind of very formal right it could be something else but hey uh you know there's always ways of testing it right now if you scroll down they actually have a video and we can play it and they're actually telling you a little bit about the product uh they have some testimonials some more uh stars uh things like that some social proof as well 
And so I don't want to. I don't want to actually watch the entire video. You can do that if you'd like later on. I just want to kind of quickly go through this uh, this landing page. And so here you have five other benefits. Okay, now they're broken down, and there's a lot of benefits. And then you you can order it right now. So let's say you want to order it now. There's one testimonial. You can do that. But most of the people are not going to order right now, right? They also have a special offer, save up to 67% today, and a money-back guarantee. These are all very, very important points because they help assuage any fears that the, the visitor has, okay? Maybe they don't like the product. Is there a guarantee? Is there a money-back guarantee? There is. Okay, check. Uh, there's a special offer, 67% today, check. There's a testimonial, check. But I'm not ready to buy it. I scroll down, and, and, and what do we have here? We have authority we have an authority we have an actual doctor dr ryan shelton nmd he's in his you know kind of the doctor attire right and this is very important because when we see a doctor you know it's like when you go to a doctor's office right a doctor tells you you have a you have an illness or you have a condition here's medicine you're not going to argue with your doctor right i mean some people i know might get a second opinion if it's something serious but chances are you're just going to listen to your doctor because he's been doing this for a while and and you know if he, he has that tire it's a legit office you're going to listen to your doctor and here we have a real doctor you know i don't know if this doctor exists but i assume he does Otherwise, you know, it's, it's not going to look good. And so there's a doctor telling you a little letter, right? They're ba he's basically trying to build rapport with you. He's saying, let's face it, many of us today lead sedentary lifestyles. Rapid advances in technology means we, we now spend much of our time sitting down, sat down, things like that. And so he's telling you, he's trying to, to really connect with you, okay? And so somebody who's reading it, they're probably going to be like, yeah, they're nodding their head in agreement, okay? And so here's a solution. Here's the problem. I agree with the problem. Here's the solution. Compression sucks. And now we start to introduce the product, right? You don't introduce the product right away because I don't want your product. I want a solution. Now, I want a solution. I want you to connect with me so that, you know, you understand what I'm going through. I don't want you to pitch me the product in the beginning, right? You don't say like, buy my socks. I don't even know why I need the socks, right? I need to connect with you. And then he says, introducing. Fortunately, there's a solution. And then, you know, he starts talking about copper Zen compression socks with circuit boost technology and copper I-10 fabric. I don't know what this means, but it, it probably means something good, right? Because it has a cool name and a special name and all of that. And there's some kind of circuit boost technology, right? Maybe it's some special technology that regular socks do not have. And so he, he tells you a little bit about this product, right? And what he's listing here is features, right? He says the exact gradual compression used in clinical studies, premium grade. These are features. These are not benefits, okay? And typically, when you are doing a landing page, you want to be talking about the benefits. But it's okay to talk about the features because it, it gives it more, uh, it, it makes it sound more legit, right? If you go out and list all the features, how it has premium grade nano size copper ions, rapid boost and, rap and blood flow, this is actually the end result. This is a benefit, but this is a feature. Uh, you know, it has all of these things, anything pertaining to the socks is a feature. People do not care about features. People care, care, care about benefits, but features are important, right? It's like when you buy a car, right? BMW, let's say we're talking about BMW, for instance, they typically list the kind of engine they have, inline six, uh, you know, 3.3, 3 liter, 3.2 liter uh, turbocharged engine. Most people don't care about this, but it makes the car look technologically advanced. And, and it is technologically advanced. And same thing with this. It, it gives it a, an element of, uh, it, it makes it look better, right? It makes it look, okay, they put a lot of time and effort into developing this. So features are important, but the benefits are going to sell. And speaking of benefits, here we get to the benefits. Five reasons to secure a pred. Now, these are benefits. This is how it's going to help me. People only care about themselves, right? This is something you have to understand. I have a problem, okay? I don't really care that there is premium grade nano size copper ions. I want to see how these things can make my life better. I want to see how they can improve circulation. I want to see how they can uh, relieve aches and pains, fight fungus, improve athletic performance, increase comfort. Comfort. I am experiencing one of these pain points or several of these or all of these. That's what people want. I don't really care about, 
you know, copper ice and fabric. When I buy a BMW, I don't care that it has an inline six or a six speed manual transmission. I care that I can take that car for a ride and it's gonna make me feel great, right? I can take it on a windy road. Uh, somewhere outside in the countryside and I have a great experience that it drives better than a, than a Toyota Camry or a Toyota Corolla or something like that and they do drive better right and that's what sells right the features is something kind of uh, to fill in parts of this landing page so it looks more legit and so we have the basic the benefits here right increased comfort and then for each of the benefit they're basically listing their special patent pending maybe or some kind of specially designed specially developed uh features right and this is why it's very important so they have a benefit and then they back it up with features it's like with a bmw right why does it drive so great because they have a special suspension because they have an inline six engine because it's 50 50 it's rear engine car with an engine in the back it gives it really nice distribution all of these things help you to prove the point i cannot just say hey this thing is going to make your life better i have to explain it i have to talk about the circle boost technology i have to talk about very you know very interesting and unique things this is all done for a reason right this is not just made up on the spot this has been done if we keep scrolling we have a very interesting part and this is called social proof they're basically showing pic pictures of real normal human beings just like yourself and that is why you see people of both sexes and of many different ethnicities right we have a white guy middle-aged guy we have uh, a black woman we have uh, maybe maybe a an asian woman or you know some kind of some kind of ethnicity woman then we have a regular white guy we have uh, another african-american man we have a, a younger woman and the, the the goal here is to make so that you can connect with so if you are you know a white guy you'll be able to connect with a white guy if you are a different ethnicity if you're a woman you'll be able to connect with somebody here this is all done because they want to show it that there's somebody just like you who experienced success right so that you can connect with this person and say okay if this person uh you know this person is just like me and they experience success they got what they wanted okay now this is going to work the same way for me so this is very important to, to understand and here we have some testimonials and i suppose there's actually a video testimonial if we click on this and it is a video right so we have a video here and we can pull it up and they basically recorded it on their phone that's why you have this kind of uh, vertical thing here and so it's very it's not like a professional video it's very amateur and that's why they work the best and so they have a video testimonials there's five oh no there's a lot more there's what three six testimonials okay six video testimonials and so me personally I don't really care about the doctor because I don't know who this doctor is I mean if this was like a world-renowned you know like an expert okay that that put his name on it okay then maybe I would care but me personally and you you might be affected in a different way what really kind of got me interested is the fact that all these people right all these people they're normal they're uh, you know your average kind of people from what they look like and they're basically um, they're basically telling you that they had good experience with this product and that is why it's very important and so you know for you it could be the doctor for me obviously it's the people so it's going to be different for each one of us okay now we scroll down we keep scrolling and so they basically they reiterate the relief you need to enjoy life and comfort okay if poor circulation right you you have your toes feeling cold swollen stiff and pain you struggle then our you know if you have this problem if you have a problem a then our product b is going to help you just imagine being able to right they're they're getting you to imagine something it's like when you go to test drive a car and the dealer uh the seller right they're basically asking you hey let's go for a test drive why do you think they they allow test drives and they start telling you hey so you know how do you feel they want you to imagine being inside the car they want you to have that emotional experience this is a very 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 powerful a uh, powerful uh, trick here right this is a powerful way to kind of sell something okay and if i scroll down finally postal worker completes for seven hour shift free from foot pain okay so they have a story about kelly is on her feet most uh, more than most and she had problems and obviously the this product solved her problems and there's a picture i don't know this looks like stock footage to me but who, i don't know right i cannot tell uh, there's a 60-day guarantee okay what if I don't like it can I return it yes you can you have 60 day no questions asked guarantee and then you have order your your compression socks 
and usually what they do is this is not the end once they present you with a uh this is called call to action right because in marketing you typically want the person to take some action you don't want them to sit around and do nothing and so if they've been reading this far you they now have a chance to purchase right and they could purchase five pairs they could save 67 percent three pairs 61 percent or one pair they still save 50 percent and here you have the pricing but it's not over yet right this is not we're about like uh two-thirds of the way down right we're about 70 percent of the world's uh of the way down but wait now they have the bonuses right this is very common to do because now you're kind of selling the person the person is kind of okay this is legit but once you put the bonuses this is where the real sales come you have you, you have a bonus gift the five pillars of healthy blood pressure okay this is something separate uh, if you scroll down and so you have one bonus okay just one bonus uh sometimes they have multiple bonuses okay but you don't want to push it too much because if you have like 10 bonuses it cheapens the product a little bit right because what what you typically do is you're listing bonuses you're also listing the price because you want the person to anchor the bonus to something i don't know what this bonus is worth okay so if there's no price maybe it's like a cheap pdf file right or something so maybe it's worth 10 bucks but they're actually saying it's a 200 dollars value so imagine you have 10 or five bonuses right of 200 bucks each right now you're giving away a thousand dollar worth of bonuses and then the product so it cheapens the product one bonus maybe two bonuses maximum uh, is something that i typically do and so they give you a bonus and here are all the benefits uh from this free video masterclass. okay you're gonna learn so many cool things the surprising reason why one in three adults struggle with blood pressure problems and the keys to lowering it and they, they talk more a little bit about the master class so bonus is kind of like it, 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 it the goal is to tip you over the scale okay the, the goal is to tip you over the scale and then once again they show you this uh call to action so now you're ready about zoom film now they need to explain a little bit about the company is this some fly by night operation that has a landing page and disappears tomorrow you know is this a real company right and from what I could tell, it's probably a real company, which is something I cannot say for a lot of, you know, sweepstakes offers or surveys or things like that. Nobody knows, if, you know, for many of them, you, you have no idea who's running that or what's going on. But with this company, right, you scroll down, there's a picture of a guy. You could probably Google for him if you'd like, learn more about him, right? Obviously, people are going to be Googling. He's talking about uh, Zoom Wellness was founded in 2017 with the sole purpose of solving health problems. Okay, there you go questions from the community very important frequently asked questions okay i have a question what is this what was copyright 10 right am i hiding something right no these are the questions there's what like 10 questions how do i know if they fit me right there's the question now how do you wash them okay you know people have been asking this question so they have frequently asked questions very important that typically goes towards the end they have also an email and a number number makes it more legit even maybe that number is being forwarded to a cell phone, but you have an 800 number, it increases conversions substantially. And typically you might wanna have it at the top of the landing page somewhere. Maybe here, call us. You want that number maybe on top. I, I've seen that increase conversion substantially. And so if we scroll down, uh, we have the frequently asked questions we have, and then we have the wellness promise. Usually there's like four elements that are, you know, the goal is to kind of uh, get you over any objection you have. So at this point, honestly, if I was looking for compression socks, I would probably buy them at this point. Like, honestly, if this was something an issue I was dealing with, it is not an issue I'm dealing with personally. But if I was, I mean, I'm pretty much sold, right? Like, if I have a problem, I'm pretty much sold at this point. Um, I would probably maybe Google the doctor, but I'm sold. And I, you know, I'm, and that, that says a lot because this is a legit landing page. And then we have... 100% satisfaction, bulletproof security, right? This is for people who are afraid of ordering on the internet. Obviously, I can see it. I'm tech savvy. I can see that this is a secure page, but you still need that. Premium support. They have a support team, cutting edge products. So, you know, obviously, these are more important support to support. I don't know what kind of support. Maybe it's going to be a guy, one guy emailing back in two days or three days. Maybe it's going to be 24 hours. I don't know cutting edge products right our researchers so we, we don't really know if they have a research lab or anything like that but it still gives it more um, more credibility and then you have references right and they have real you know this is like real references right rochester.edu telegraph real sites right they have nih 
uh, National Institute of Health, I believe this stands for, .gov, right? So this is real references from legitimate government, uh, some of them are government publications, right? And this is legit. And then we scroll down, we have the address, right? We have the actual, the street, the suite, you know, they have the city and all this. So all of this is very important, okay? All of this is super important. And so privacy disclaimer, anti-spam, refund policy, things like that. And so, you know, this is, a, in my opinion, this is a pretty legit landing page, okay? And every element in this page is done in an order for a reason, right? It's a science now. Building a landing page is a science. And to show you what I mean, I basically Googled for... Uh, a good structure of a sales pages that sell. And they actually follow uh, a very common structure. You have the headline, subheadline, presentation of the problem, introduction of your product as the solution, social proof, bonuses, offer guarantee, calls to action. So it looks like they basically went ahead and copied this formula uh, because it pretty much follows it down to the T. And so, you know, there you go, create killer headlines, presentations, so you can read more about it. But these things sell, they really do sell provided that the person actually has a problem that they're, they're you know, searching for. Obviously, if you are looking at it because I'm doing a case study, you're not gonna buy this product. But if somebody who has a problem and they are, you know, they're like, well, they have, they have a lot of skepticism, right? They're not sure, is it gonna solve the problem? Is it not? Well, this thing is gonna, is gonna do it. Now, obviously you can, you can link to this uh, landing page and you, know, you could send traffic to it. But if you're familiar with the niche, if you're familiar with kind of the area, I'm not familiar with this niche at all, but let's say this was an area I knew something about, maybe dating, maybe relationships, uh, maybe biz up, right? These are the areas I'm more familiar with. Obviously you can become familiar in any area you want, but you know, it is what it is, right? If you've been doing something for a while, you, you get some kind of experience in it. And so what I'm trying to say is that if this is an area I was familiar with, I would Create, I would probably know of another angle, right? Maybe it's something else. Maybe, you know, maybe this is about fungus, right? People are buying it for fungus. So I wanna have, I wanna maybe change the headline and say, hey, are you, you know, tired of having fungus, tired of these embarrassing moments in the locker room, right? This is kind of what sells, right? Selling is, you know, 90% emotional. It's maybe 80, 90, at least like 85, 90% emotional. Selling is emotional. It's not a logical process. You don't convince a person that they need your product. You make it an emotional, you appeal to their emotions. So let's say, you know, it's a high school kid and he's basically on a sports team and he has fungus, you know, like foot, foot fungus or some kind of, that kind of disease. And he's embarrassed, right? He's embarrassed of changing. Maybe somebody else will see it, things like that. As an example, right? This is what you're talking about because this is gonna be the number one reason in that example for that person to actually be interested in the product. The fear, the fear of going through with this, right? The fear of that, right? A lot of our emotions are really, it's, 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 it's irrational, right? We don't know why we feel that way and we need a solution. We want this feeling to go away. And a lot of times it's a pain, right? It's a lot easier to sell a pain point than to actually uh, sell a, a product as a nice to have. So this product actually, it sells a pain point, okay? Uh, instead of a nice to have weight loss, fitness, it's a pain point, right? Weight loss, um, you know, you, 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 it's not nice to have, right? If you're overweight, it's a pain point, right? You want to get rid of that weight. A nice to have product is like a, you know, maybe a new tripod for your camera that, that hinges a different way. You don't need that product. You don't care about that product, but it's nice to have. It's gonna make your life better. Or maybe a newer laptop, it's nice to have. You don't need it. Or maybe a newer phone, you have the iPhone uh, 11, or you have the iPhone 10, you wanna buy 11. That's a nice to have product. That's why Apple is, is talking about all the new features, all the new benefits, but it's a nice to have. This is a pain point, all right, guys? So how do you build the landing page, right? So I went ahead and basically I'm using a tool and this tool comes with templates and I typically start out with a template, okay? I don't really, you know, it's a lot easier to start with a template because you know, everything is already pre-built. I already have the tool here. And all I need to do is basically fill in with my information. So I'm not gonna spend too much time on this. I just wanna show you the process really, really quickly so that you understand where we're coming from. So let's say we have an imaginary product and this is a uh, some kind of a weight loss tea 
Now, I haven't really been promoting this product. I know they exist on ClickBank, maybe even on Max Bounty. I've seen them on ClickBank and supposedly they sell really well. But I haven't seen a landing page in like a while, so I don't remember it. So we're just going to go off memory. And so here you have the headline, right? And what you want is you want to appeal to that person, right? You want to connect with them immediately. So whatever you write here, they need to catch the attention of the person. Uh, you know, you could write something like, you know, interesting tea or unique tea helps you, helps you shed off those pounds, helps you shed off those pounds, right? And we're just going to go together, right? Really quickly or unique tea or unknown tea unknown to you or something like you need some kind of something that gets the person's um, attention right makes them curious unknown tea helps that you shed off those pounds right those extra pounds or something like that unknown tea or specialty right specialty or something like that and that's kind of what you want here you have here you have a sub headline so maybe you want to say something like you know ever ever wanted to lose ever wanted to lose that extra weight well, now you can. Well, now you can. And what this does is it, it makes you curious about what's going on, right? And now you want to, you know, the purpose of the headline is to make you read the subheadline. The purpose of the subheadline is to make you read the rest of it, right? And so here you can kind of talk about some of the benefits, right? You, it says emphasize a big problem of frustration. So you can kind of follow the structure. So if we have this, right, we can put possibly go and we could presentation of the problem so what is the problem they're dealing with that problem can be uh going on a diet that problem having the six pack that problem so it's going to be different for each of the person right you need to get inside of the of the of the you know of the visitor right of your prospect and to figure out because you know if somebody is really overweight then they need to lose like you know like say 30 40 pounds right if somebody is a little bit overweight maybe they want that six pack then that's the that's what you should be going with right it's gonna it's gonna be different depending on where the person is at so let's say we we're basically talking about a person that wants to lose that extra pounds so that's kind of what we talked about those extra hard to get rid of you know hard to get rid of hard to get rid of something like that rid of pounds right and obviously you can fix this all but this is you want to focus on something like this because they're so so hard to get rid of right and this is i guess you could hyphenate it you know uh, something like that maybe you can capitalize it things like that you can do that and it makes that extra emphasis right They've got, they've lost a lot of weight, but they can't lose that little extra, you know, just to have that six pack, things like that. And so you can talk about the six pack, and but I would, what I would do is I would basically change all of this and say, um, I would bas be basically writing a letter. So I would, you know, uh, maybe I would list some of the benefits here, lose, lose those extra pounds, you know, um, you know, feel better, right? Feel better about yourself about yourself these are the extra benefits uh that you're going to be experiencing here we're going to have the picture of the tea right so you know i haven't found the picture so, so assume you have a picture of the tea here or you know the product itself which you're going to get from the merchant and here you're going to have another benefit so lose ex those extra pounds feel better about yourself um you know live longer inc live longer and, and healthier something like that and obviously this is something you, you'll have to research, right, and figure out because there could be better, better benefits, okay? Uh, I would remove all this and I may, may have a picture of a doctor here. So I will probably remove this and something like this. And that's the benefits. Now, here you have appeal to the emotion of the person. You know, I tried everything. I, I tried everything for weight loss. I tried everything for weight loss and nothing worked until and then i can write everything right and this basically i'm trying to connect to the reader assuming that my reader has also tried everything and nothing worked and i can basically talk about you know i was uh, talk about some of the feelings right i was maybe i was you know i was with, with with a child right with my child and let's say my son or my daughter basically said hey you gain weight you're fat or something right there's an emotional moment right there is an emotional moment or i went to see an old friend he's like wow man you've gained a lot of weight or something like that or i went to see my mom i haven't seen her in a while and she says something like that so it's got to be something that hits you emotionally right and this is something you would write here so i'll just quickly do that you know very quickly 
Uh, recently, I saw my mom after two years of being abroad or something like that. Those, the first words, and I'm not going to tell you about the story of my mom. I want to tell you the, the feeling of shame as she told something like this. Or this could be anything, right? This could be, you know, it, it could be any experience where you had this, you know, very negative feeling with this problem. For instance, weight loss. The first words, even before she greeted me, and obviously a mom would never do that typically, right? So you kind of have to adjust the story. Even before she greeted me, she had a chance to greet me she she looked at me and said wow you're fat <laughs> and of course a mom is never gonna say that but you guys understand what i'm saying somebody else might say that an old friend might say that you know so you know, maybe a younger child might say that right because they they're typically they don't have a filter so they could say that you're fat something like that and that's a good start because this captures the visits attention right and now they have a, a box so what you want to do is you want to talk a little bit here maybe have something else maybe a statistic something like that and then you scroll down uh you can write something like this you know i tried everything for weight loss nothing worked and then you could say something like until i discovered you know this special this special affiliate tea okay affiliate tea affiliate hustle tea or something like this and then you can write about it now at this point the user is a little skeptical tea can lose my weight and then you basically you can talk about the tea right this tea comes from the special amazon sub subtropical region it's been used by locals for many many years and it, it has all these great vitamins and minerals and you know it helps you lose weight and all these things right and then you have your storytelling you might i would talk about the tea okay and then you have maybe so obviously you have some images um at this point after the t i want to maybe talk about some studies right maybe a doctor in a study they did some study things like that right you want to you want to give it more authority right at this point it's just storytelling you're basically telling somebody that hey this t helps a lot of problems you want you want some kind of authority right you want that like they had the doctor in the in the other page and so you're building your case you're building your case and after the doctor you want more people right so you want testimonials right and so you can get testimonials from people that perhaps bought the product if you're selling it yourself or you can ask the merchant for testimonials you want testimonials okay you want to see other people are doing it and you can have regular testimonials right you don't need this crazy uh you don't need all these crazy testimonials with pictures and videos that's a plus that's a plus because that that gives it more credibility it makes it more legit but you want more testimonials because when you when i buy something people do what other people are doing people mimic other people and so if i see a lot of other people are uh having their problem solved with this tea they're losing weight maybe there's before and after picture now for the yeah exactly so for this kind of product it's very good to have on a before and after picture like you have a lot of these weight loss products they really help to sell so if you can get those kind of uh, images it's going to make a big difference and so once you did the you know kind of the social proof the testimonials and all that you can talk a little bit about the product say hey this tea is going to help you with six benefits then you can present the bonus right now i'm sold i i know there's a doctor i know that it comes from maybe uh the amazon region of brazil for instance and people have been using it and that makes it look legit because that's why I never heard of it. That's why nobody has heard of it because it's been used in, in the Amazon region of Brazil. And so I've never heard of it, right? That's why it makes it even more believable, right? If we're talking about a product that everybody has used, then, you know, and it doesn't work, otherwise people would, you know, would be losing weight, that, that's different. So in this case, I'm talking about some special product and you've never heard of it because it hasn't been marketed to the US, right? Until now, right? This is a very important thing. We have some testimonials. We scroll down. And here you wanna you wanna start with your first call to action, right? Typically I do anywhere from like two to three call to actions per page. So you want to have at least two call to actions, right? Because at this point the person might be ready to buy. And you typically want to also have it at the top, purchase now right if they're ready to buy because they may have seen your landing page a couple of times and they just want to go back and click purchase right and so they want to buy it and so you have your first call to action 
somewhere in the middle of the page and then you have more maybe some benefits you want to list some some um you want more right so what they're doing in this other page they're basically talking about the uh postal worker right and that's what you want you want more stories people connect using stories so you want to have another story uh a mother of five or a mother of three kids uh, was undergoing uh, problems and things like that and so you want to connect with your story and that is very important and so after that you want to you know maybe list a couple of more things you want to have another call to action then you want to have a uh, satisfaction guarantee frequently asked questions and that's pretty much it then you might want to have another call to action towards the end and that is how you create a landing page okay so i don't want to make this video too long it has already been pretty long but i really hope by this point you have a better idea how to create landing pages and it gets a lot easier through time okay so i really hope you've gotten some value out of this video i really hope you learned something if you have any questions or comments leave them below would be very very happy to answer you uh, if you enjoyed this video definitely smash the like button and if you want to see more videos such as this one where we talk about everything concerning digital marketing everything you need to know definitely subscribe to the channel click the notification bell so again thank you so much for, for watching and i really hope this video was helpful and i will see you in the next video